we want to find the frequency of the sine wave y equals the cosine of 100 pi x. So how in the world are we going to do that? Well, we need to know how do you find the frequency. So we know that frequency equals 1 over the period. Oh, but you know, to get the period, I'm going to have to know b, so I'm going to have to set this into our standard form. So how do we do that? Remember, so this is going to be y equals the cosine of, I need to get x all by itself, so I'm going to factor out the 100 pi, and then I'm going to multiply that by x, now plus what? Well, I've got to multiply by 0 to get rid of that for c, and then that whole thing is going to be plus 0. Okay, so now I know what b is, right? So b equals 100 pi, and I know that the period for cosine is 2 pi over b, so this is going to be 2 pi over 100 pi, so that's going to give me 1 over 50. So that's p. So if f equals 1 over p, I'm going to get 1 over 1 over 50. And that's just going to give me 50. So the frequency of this sine wave is 50.